And we're back with some more. Let's learn Hearthstone. So we're still with our Paladin deck. Pa Paladin deck. Wow. Starting off with a um, derp at the start. And we're 8 and 2. So let's see if we can go for more. Or if this will be our last game. Who knows. I have a cup of drink of water with me. You should get a drink too. And let's get started. Okay. So we're versus a rogue. Let's hope we'll do fine. So. Cogmaster. I'd like to keep the Imp Master. I don't want to keep Avenge. I'll keep, I want to draw that later. Hopefully, get a two drop maybe. Or no, we get the exact opposite. Our super late game card. So this is gonna be a dead card for God knows how long. Oh, Recombobulator, which I won't be using. Kind of a crappy hand because next turn I have to hero power. He's gonna coin into what? Oh. That's kind of awkward. Oh, but I can kill that now. So hit it. Seal of light. Hit. I think it was an alright play since next turn I have Imp Master and I don't want that to deal with my Imp Master. So, so he's just gonna dagger here. And now Lexter can play Imp Master. Nope, Imp Master it is. Neither am I, Imp Master. I am not a morning person at all. Okay, so let's see what he has. A, he's a, a three drop. That that's good. That's a very good three drop. So we can't kill it right now, actually. So I'm probably gonna have to no mish next turn and see what happens. Yep, no mish. And hit hit in the face or oh, hit him, her, she, him, her, it, whatever. We just we tried to kill her. Doesn't matter what gender she, he, it is. Okay, so cool. Now I can kill that. No cut. Okay. This is getting to be annoying. He has really good minions that I can't really kill. Okay, shielded minibots. I could have used you ages ago. So I think we shielded. And then we hit. And who the doctor it. I'm so scared of MC Tech. I don't want to play Hero Power. Assassin's Blade, that's super slow. Okay, this is gonna go face. Or he's gonna kill that. Okay. She okay, that's a really good draw actually. So that, kill that, and hit him. Okay, that's good. We're still ahead, we still have a, a better board than he does, although it's a kind of a crappy board since he can kill it at Assassin's Blade. But yeah, I don't think I want to assassin blade the two one though. We'll see. Next turn, I don't have anything to play. I don't have a seven drop in my hand, so we'll be reacting to what he's playing. Oh, okay, a mana wraith. So double something. I have nothing to play, but that clogs up his hand too. So maybe he wants to bait me into using my my true silver. No, actually, I'm gonna kill the four four. Screw that. So let's kill the four four. Let's see what we draw. Oh, abusive sergeant. Do I want to use that to kill that? Hmm. I kind of want to. I kind of want to. But that clogs up his hand too. Next turn is I have eight mana and I can play the force tank. So yeah, I'll just I'll kill that. I'll hero power and then avenge. He might assume it's normal sacrifice, so he won't hit with his face. But if he does hit his face, then this gets buffed. So, or if he kills this, this gets buffed. Hopefully, oh, fell of knives would be the worst, but okay, that's fine. He doesn't have fell of knives. Oh, he passed. Okay. So now let's just go ahead and play the force tank, kill this, and go face. If he if he has an assassinate, that means Onyxia is free to roam because I doubt he has two assassinates in hand. That would suck. So let's see how we react. We're in pretty good shape. If he kills this with fan, or if he kills that, that gets avenged. So that probably, as I'm assuming, he has a um, what's it called? Uh, oh, yes. Does it, he has, does he have an assassinate? Oh, he doesn't. Okay. So Earth is gonna kill this first. Okay, let's kill that. 
see what we get. Oh, that's kind of really crappy, actually. And then we'll play Onyxia. And yeah, we'll see where that goes. Did you just say do you dare challenge the daughter of De Deathwing? That's really cool. Okay. I did not know that. I don't play World of Warcraft. It's just a thing for World of Warcraft. I don't play it, so... I wouldn't know. Okay, so we're in a pretty good position. He has to... He has to sack both of his cards in it, and I do have a force tank to, to reckon with, so... Okay. Okay. And now he's gonna kill... How, you can't kill that. He's just drawing as many cards as possible, or he's gonna take 10 damage to the face. I don't know, we'll see. He is drawing a lot of cards. Eviscerate. No, he can't eviscerate. Or he can. Whoops, my bad. I've overestimated the the cost of eviscerate. So then he's gonna kill that, okay. Pretty efficient board clearing, but he did take a crap ton of damage to the face, so... That's fine. Um... Do I want to? I don't really want to, like... Uh, the Argent Protectoring something. And should I Rusty Horn something? I could Rusty Horn a, a Whelp, just so it has to hit it first. I could Rusty Horn it and then Argent Protector it. Mm, is that a good play? No, not particularly. I'm just gonna Rusty Horn it. And see where it goes from there. Just so that it's even more annoying. If he has Fan of Knives, he can clear it. Okay, he's drawing a crap ton of cards. Jeez. That's super annoying. Okay, Zombie Chow. That heal is good. That's bad. That's super bad. Oh, Blessing of Wisdom. That could be useful here. So, I think I'll Blessing of Wisdom this ship's cannon and Argent Protector it. So, Blessing of Wisdom, hit that. Uh, white, py white Pyro isn't really useful here. Hit it with my Whelp. And then, Argent Protector. And, let's play a lot, all the things. This way, he can't hit it. He can't fan of knives it. And that's still protected. Now, hopefully his Ogre Brute doesn't attack doesn't attacks one of my 1-1s, or maybe even goes, goes face, so that then I can Argent, I mean, Aldor Peacekeeper that. Yeah, that's fine. Dagger there. And he's probably gonna kill my Pyro, that's fine too. Okay. That's something to get aldor Okay, so let's Aldor Peacekeeper that. Let's play our Yeti. Now, how do I want to clear this? I think I just put my 1 1 into his 2 1, okay. And then, he, then he might hit his his fell river into my ship's cannon. Oh, I should have drawn first. That was really that was a mistake. But then he can dagger and hit it anyway. So is there a way this ship's cannon lives? Not particularly. I think I'll just silver hand recruit, hit him in the face. Yeah, Lord of the Ring would have been a better play. Yeah, I should have drawn first. Yep, that's always a mistake. You always should draw first. Like if you if you don't know if like your if like your hand is particularly straightforward, you should always draw first so that it changes your perspective maybe. Yeah, it's gonna take more damage to the face. Which is fine. Don't hit it, thank you. One one. Or face, that's the best place. Face is the fa fa face is the place. Yes, well played. Yep, the Aldor Peacekeeper and the Fell Reaver is the, probably the best I could have done. So we're nine and three, awesome. Nine and nine and two, not nine and three. I'm stupid. If we're nine and three, we'd be losing. No, nine and two. Okay, so one more win and we get one to my high score in arena. Because this is this is currently my high score in arena with with probably a priest. I always remember. So let's see. Okay, so versus another rogue, is it the same one? No, no, it's not the same one. 
So ship everything. Yep, that's that's the way to go. Hopefully it gets our ones and twos. Two, three, and one. Oh great, that's a crappy two and that's not a playable one. Please give me another two. Oh no, that is far from a two, so I probably have to recombobulate next turn. Which is terrible. Let's see. So he's gonna coin out a two drop, so I'll probably have to look. The pleasure is mine. Well met. So I'm just gonna hero power here. If he wants to hero power, that's fine. But I don't want to recombinate just so he can have a free trade. Yeah, he can hero power. I'm probably going to have to Aldor Peacekeeper. It is a waste, but I don't have see anything I can do. Yeah, I have another Aldor Peacekeeper right there. I could recombobulate. If I could have recombobulated plus Hero Power plus Avenge, I would have done that, but I can't. And I can't just Hero Power and f pass. Or I could, but I don't think that would grant me much. So I'm just going to Aldor Peacekeeper. Just so I can have a body on the board. It is a 3-3. He has to hit both of his minions in. Or maybe his face, plus this. But we'll see. I, I do have another in hand, so... It's kind of useless. It is, an, it is an awkward hand. I didn't get my ones and twos, or my good twos. Which sucks, but you know. Like if I had, um... My, what's it called? My, my trog, it would have been better, but you know. It happens. We might lose this. Oh, backstab. That's never good. So, hit, hit it with this, and then hit go face. And now I think I have to recombinate plus hero power plus avenge. Unless I draw a really good two drop. Oh, I could Kazan. Kazan is going to be totally useless. So what would it, so what would it be the better play? So I have recombinator and plus this plus avenge. So if I do this, he he trades one of his two twos into it. And then this becomes a 3-2 that becomes a 4-3. Which then he could face and hero power it. I mean face and hit him with the other 2-1. Um, I could save my recombinator for later, which is kind of greedy, but you know. I think I'm just going to play on curve. He says to use a 2-1 and, and hit it in the face. We'll see. I do have healing, so taking face damage is not the worst. So if he decides to ignore it, that's fine. But he probably hit his loot holder in and hit him in his face. Let's, let's see. Next turn, I probably have to Dragon Consort. Yeah, hit his face. Then he'll, probably, then he'll play a 4 drop, probably. Or 2 twos. Oh, 4 drop, that's fine. So I'll Dragon Cold Sword next turn, and then recombobulate it if he doesn't kill it. So Dragon Cold Sword here. I'm just trying to play on curve, to be honest, because none of his dudes kill it, and if he wants to hear power and take a damage, it's fine. He can assassinate it, but I have more, I have more threatening things so he could assassinate, which would be great. So I think I'll just hit hit this with that if he doesn't kill it, and then recombobulate it. But it looks like he's going to take the face damage. Which I wouldn't necessarily agree. Unless he has healing, which he might have. He might have an anti heal button there. Or he could do that. Okay, so he's going to put his, put his one ones and two ones in there and then hits his face. That is taking five damage to the face, which, you know, it's fine by me. So, okay. So, True Silver Champion doesn't do much for me. So, I could I'm ship scan in. I think I ship scan in and then and be greedy. Because if I just true silver, that doesn't die. And I don't really have a, a, a really good 7 play anyway, so. Um, I think I, yeah, I'll just do this and avenge. And let's see what he does from there. <clears throat> because at least if he trades something, the, the avenge will trigger and then I could still kill it with my true silver next turn, so. We're in a good position. We're both at 20 HP. He does have a, 
a card advantage over me by one card, which is not the worst. So we'll see. I do I, I do have a really good late game. Oh, now he's ahead of me in cards. But I do have a really good late game, so... If we keep stacking this out, that's fine. I do have Hogger. I haven't seen Hogger in a while. I don't. I haven't seen him last game. Okay, so that's gonna get avenged. And does he dagger again? Okay, he daggers. So, okay, that turns into that through silver and hit that. That's fine. Okay. Oh, I could Onyxia. The, that is a thing. Onyxia. Um, I could Onyxia. Uh, that, I think that's what I'm going to do. Do I save Onyxia? Do I want to be greedy? You know what? Screw it. YOLO Onyxia time. It is YOLO. If he has assassinate, would have used it earlier. Hopefully didn't draw into it, which would suck. But, you know, suck it. Fuck it. Onyxia time. It's always time for Onyxia. Oh, Fan of Knives, okay, so that's fine, doesn't have an Assassinate. And Assassinate is 5 mana, so I can't use it. Oh, that is awesome, that is awesome. So I'll probably Blessing of Wisdom that. Okay, Jungle Panther. That still doesn't kill that, unfortunately. Well, unfortunately for him, not for- Oh yeah, cool, cool, okay. So let's Blessing of Wisdom this anyway. Hit it, hit him in the face. Okay, cool. So that doesn't change our turn. That's Garden of Kings. And this was this is what winning looks like. Awesome. Also, this is the only seven drop a paladin has, and there are like maybe I don't know, eight or nine other sevens. I'm not sure. I I wanted to Google that later. So this was like a one and nine. The Recombobulator recombobulates back into Garden of Kings and that other games. That was so weird that that happened. Jesus. Yes, how do you deal with this? This is winning. I'm gonna get my 10 twindy guys. I'm so excited. Hype. 10 wins hype. Okay. So, let's see. I do have lethal on the board. Even if it doesn't kill this, I do have uh, 8 plus 4. So, that is lethal. Unfortunately, I don't have lethal if he kills this. If he kills Onyxia. But I don't think he has an answer to it. And if he has a taunt, I can always choose silver death and kill it. So, we'll see. Cold blood deals with Onyxia fine. To kill Onyxia. Oh, that is the one stupid freaking thing I couldn't kill. Then he's gonna go face. Okay. So wait, no wait, I still have lethal. No, I don't, I don't, I don't. So I'm gonna hit that with that. Oh, cog hammer. Okay, so first let's hit. And then, I'll hit again. I cut out of pain, okay, it doesn't change my turn much. And then I'll Aldor Peacekeeper. No, 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 no. I'll first, first I'll Cog Hammer. That's, that's probably the best place to go. Then, do that. Hit it. Oh, I thought Cog Hammer did 3 damage. Oops, I'm stupid. Never mind. Do you know what? Just don't see what I'm doing. Do you know? Just turn off your 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 your. Just mute me right about now, or change your tab. That was so stupid. I forgot. I thought Cog Hammer did three damage. Oh God! It's little things I'm stupid in. I could have killed the stupid uh, Sun Cleric, and then hit, then that'd be a one one. Oh God, I'm dumb. Anyway, whatever. I have little. I can't really get through Anixia with a Divine Shield and Taunt, so he's dead. Yeah, really so many options, not particularly. You seem to be taking a while with your so many options. So, 3, 5, that's 8, 8 plus 2 is 10, so I do have a lethal with 2 silver. He has to kill everything. Deadly poison. Oh, Tinker Oil. Okay, that deals with that. Don't throw a taunt. Don't put a taunt. Don't put a taunt, you asshole. Okay, so I win. Awesome. He's gonna take the damage to the face, probably. Yep, I win. So, hit him. And through silver. And win. 
So my 10 20 guys, I finally got to my 10. Let's see if we can get to maybe 11 or 12. I don't know who see who knows. So okay, our quest. So tent wind, let's leave the key. Oh look at that frozen key. That's so pretty. Okay. Let's see if we can get to our eleventh or twelfth win. I'm so excited. I've never gotten this far in arena. Okay, so we got our worthy opponent and it's another paladin. Let's hope we don't get blood knighted like the last time we lost. So let's ship ship and hopefully get another two drop. Yep, we got our pyro, so it's fine. I could coin out Pyro and then the Vine shield it next turn. Oh yeah, I'll just coin out ship scanning since I have one and since I have two other two drops. Reporting for duty. And then I'll hit and and Argent protector that. So wait, wait, hit then Argent protector. Since I don't want to waste the Divine Shield just to kill a 1-1. One -one. So next turn I have Imposters, which will trade with his hero power. Oh, Harvest Golem, you asshole. So, Imposter and go face. I don't see any point in trading into it since he will get a 2-1 anyway. So this this way I'll he'll trade into me and then I'll, I'll see what he does. Call that a weapon. That's a really good answer, actually. Okay, do I want to cog hammer? Not particularly. So wait, wait. I could do this and then cog hammer, or this. You know what? I'm gonna do this and cog hammer. And if it hits this, fantastic. If it doesn't, sucks. Success. Okay, cool. It did. So hit and hit. And then repentance. It's super weak to consecrate, which probably does, but you know what? Screw it. Oh god. Well, that's fine. I'm just gonna get repentance so I can hit with my face. Then Dragon Consort. Yep, no need to. Bless your wisdom here. Better play a curve. So hit that, hit my face, and then face. And hopefully we'll draw next year, not our fairy dragon. <laughs> then if he plays a, a big dude, that's 6 mana, I can Aldor Peacekeeper that. Or he can Aldor Peacekeeper my thing, so. Oh, oh, oh. I was going to Blessing of Wisdom and hit it. But, the, but, but I got a taunt. So do I want to kill this? This is this is the most annoying thing here. Not particularly. I'm gonna hit and hit and then go face. Again, weak to consecrate, but oh, you know what? Screw it. He he didn't use consecrate before. Doubt he drew it into na into it now. Maybe he doesn't have one like me. So that's three damage. Okay. And then what? Another one? Oh, the archer protector. Okay. So that was an efficient wave, a war clear, not wave clear. So do I? So I could do this and then hit that to that. Or so let's see if we can be fancy. So I could uh, bard pyro hit do a blessing of wisdom on this, and then hit it. Hmm. That would leave me there. No, you know what? Screw it. I'd rather do this, hit that ship scan in, and then hit him in the face. This is need a big, with a stronger board than if I had done what I was trying to do before. So for Wild Pyro, I have a Blessing of Wisdom, I have an Avenge, and I have a Seal of Light. So I have three spells. It's not the greatest, because one of them is a secret, one of them is a Blessing of Wisdom. So that's going to get Altor Peacekeepered. Oh, that's Avenge or Noble Sack. So just in case it's Avenge, let's hit first. It's Noble Sack. Okay, it's fine. That's over a sec. So now we'll, we'll Aldor Peacekeeper, 
and then truck. Because if it was Avenge, I did not. I could have hit that, and he would have avenged here, and then have Aldor Peacekeeper did. So, which would have been a fantastic play, but sucks was no Wizak. Because now he can put both his creatures into my Guardian of Kings. If he cho so chooses. Oh, that is bad. That is that is far from good. That is... Oh, no. Sea Giant is the worst. Direwolf Alpha. Okay. So he's going to kill some other minions. Oh, okay. Blessing of Wisdom. So that gets, gets bigger. And it goes face. You know, I should have drawn first, to my opinion. Oh, forced. Forced tank max. Okay. So, I'm definitely gonna kill this. So, let's put a Blessing of Wisdom onto my thing. And hit it. Maybe to change. Oh, it does. It, it could change my turn. I could Aldor Peacekeeper. Which I think I will. I'll Aldor Peacekeeper. And then he's in face. And you know what? Then I'll play. And then I'll play. Hero power. For duty. <clears throat> and we'll see. He probably is gonna kill this Alder Peacekeeper. That these are two useless minions now. Unless he Blessing of Kings them. Okay, Hammer of Wrath. He's drawing more cards. That's his second Hammer of Wrath. Screw you, man. I didn't get any. Okay. Blessing of Wisdom. He's gonna draw him another card. And he's gonna hit with that. Oh, true silver champion. Okay. So now I'll force tank. Force tank plus hero power. Portals online. Oh, no, not particularly good. Heal of light. Seal of light. Uh, or uh, wait, I could have seal of lighted and then hit it. So I think I'll do that next turn. He can't kill this unless he takes seven damage to the face. So he could either put this into that or his blessing of wisdom into that and then hit it. I should probably stop hero powering. He, I keep giving him cards when I hero power. Jesus, I, f I forget about that. Oh, it's gonna take seven damage to the face. Just to clear the divine shield? What does he have then? Okay, and then he's gonna put both minions. Oh, wow, okay. I'd like my true silver actually. So I can kill this stupid thing. Da, 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 da. So I'll wild pyro. Seal of light. Hit this stupid thing and hit and shield the mini. And hero power, screw it. If he wants to draw more cards from this stupid thing, he's I'll let him. Because if he just kills this, then I can kill kill the, his his other board. So. Now I can kill that stupid thing finally. Okay, hero power. And what does he have? For Argus. That sucks. That is the worst. And another secret. So I think I lose. Oh, get fucked, man. You got the definition of fucked. What is that? Avenge. Oh, get fucked. I'm gonna just hit this stupid thing. I could have passed, but I need to hit it. He doesn't have lethal, right? Four. That's ten. That's eleven damage. Oh, this is getting hairy. So it's gonna hit. Hopefully it buffs this. Buff this. Buff this. Thank you. The best place to put the buff. Um. I'll put it on your oh god, that is the worst. Oh no. Oh, that is awful. That is literally the worst. And he's gonna draw another stinking card. And now he's gonna hit this? No, he's gonna face. Face the place. He has lethal. Or not, yeah, he has perfect lethal. Oh, Onyxia. 
You don't really save me. Light it up. Yeah, two. That's two plus two is four. Plus five is nine. Plus one, perfectly till there. And oh well, we ha we went to ten wins. It's not the worst, not the best, but yeah, I'll get a new personal record. And I would lose versus a paladin. Yeah, I, I, anyway, I need a taunt. Yeah, to win, I needed a taunt. It's not the worst. No, not the best. Okay, we get it. He had more removal than I did, which sucked. And yeah. So, 10 wins. Let's see what we get. We will definitely get our gold back. Let's see what, like, other awards. So, 90 gold, 120 gold. Oh, that's a lot of gold. And a pack. Cool. Okay. And now I have 100, 570 gold. Holy crap. So, let's open the pack, see what we get. Oh, a legendary. Oh, Malganis. Okay. That's my first. That's awesome. That's. I didn't have Malganis before, so. That's great. Okay, so let's disenchant, disenchant the extra cards I got. And let's see. Let's buy another arena and see what classes there are. Hopefully, there's Mage. I love Mage. Um, excuse me. Thank you. Oh, okay, so I'll probably Shaman or Warlock, maybe Paladin next time. So, yes, that was my 10 and 3 Paladin run. If you enjoyed any of my parts, do feel free to leave a like, leave a comment, and tips, tricks, commentary on my plays is always appreciated. I'll st oh, look, 420 gold. Holy shit, that is the best. Okay, so I'll see you in my next Let's Learn. Well, we'll either play one of these three classes. If you have a, an idea, feel free to leave a comment. And yeah, I'll see you in the next part, you guys. Bye!